welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Sylvia, 37 year old, and I'm a makeup addict. And I'm finally filming again. It took a while, it took some energy. Um, I'm not editing yet, so let's hope I'll do that. But uh, yeah, life's tough at the moment. Not tough, it's tough, but you know, I've got a new job. It's weird that dad is not here anymore. And it's just taking a toll. So I am filming mostly TikToks, but I haven't filmed makeup videos in a while and editing is still a struggle so but also but i think also a lot of because of the new job at the reception desk and i really have to get used to the hours even though it's nine to five now which is really nice but um yeah it feels a little weird um not to be yeah to be honest so it's hard to plan everything so yeah and i could have done this fairly early in the day but i didn't it's almost half past eight in the evening when i'm filming but uh, who cares but i'm excited because i've got something new and exciting uh, I've got the Nomad Cosmetics Bosque Nuboso de Monteverde, the new palette. Look how pretty that looks. I mean, come on. That is just packaging wise beautiful. And this is the sleeve it came in on the back. It has all the colors and yeah, it was just so pretty with this in it. It was so, so nice. And yeah, I can't wait to play with it. I've, who oh, did I take this out? Nope. Let's take the sleeve out and you know look at this i have swatched it all it is on my instagram if you want to see the swatches but of course in this video as well i'm going to swatch it at the end but look how amazing this looks i have no idea what to do yet so yeah there's that i just take the mirror if there are no thing on the mirror film on the mirror but there's not so we cannot take it out for satisfaction which i really enjoy no more. so yeah i have no clue what to do but there's some really nice colors in here, and I'm gonna try a lot of them. Ooh. Oh, and I love the prints on it. You can see I've put my fingers in it, but there's like little monkeys on this brown one. Then there's little birds on this one. And then the flowers on this one. So, so pretty. I really like it. And it looks like there's shells on them. Oh, really love this palette. Nomad Cosmetic, I'm really falling in love with them. I have several videos up on my TikTok of them. I have another video of their latest palette on my YouTube. So go check it all out if you want to. They're really amazing, doing really great. And uh, oh, I'm going to play with this and have fun. And do, of course, a Sylvia style video. So, because uh, yeah, that's the channel we are on. And <laughs> let's hope I can get back into everything and just. I love doing makeup. I really do. I just. Can't find the time that good at this moment. So yeah, let's get in to this beautiful palette. And uh, if you do like me, then please subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell, give me a comment, give me a like. It would be amazing, mean the world to me. And uh, yeah, let's just enjoy this makeup. So we're going to start with Blue Morpho. I'm going to put this on to this brush. I... I'm gonna check. This is 03 by Refer. Of course, you've seen it because it's in the lines, but I cannot see it when I do my voiceover. Look at that blue. Oh, it's so good. So, yeah, I'm hopefully back. Took me a while to get back to editing. I filmed this very, very long time ago when this was brand new. And I just got it. And I never edited it. So, let's hope uh, you love it just as much as I do because this still is an amazing palette. Uh, these colors are so beautiful, so vibrant. I mean, look at this go on. I just love this color. It's so pretty. Yeah, enjoying this process. And watching this back, to be honest, I really love it when I love the palettes. Now let's go in with a resplendent quad soul. I'm pronouncing these all wrong, I know. I'm sorry. And this is a... Beautiful P. Louise brush, the 116, my favorite small brush. I almost use it for every single look I use because it's so nice and small and blends so nicely. I love it. This is so good. Anyone you want to don't like it, send it to me. No problem. No, just kidding. But yeah, this is a nice color with a nice brush and it's working very well. Now go in with a violet subbrewing. And again, on a different O3 from Refer, also one of my favorite brushes to do detailed work. Really nice. Oh, 
so pretty. Look at that. So love it. This palette is so nice. It really is. I'm so sorry for Nomad Cosmetics that I was so late posting this. I hope people will still watch it. But yeah. Um, it is such a nice palette. And I... Like I said, I've been on TikTok, so if you want to see any of this or any current stuff, go to TikTok as well. I am on there, I'm on TikTok, I'm on Instagram, but at the moment mostly on TikTok. And this color is Orchid, and again it's on a 116 P. Louise brush. And we're going to use this on top of the other color. Ah, oh, it's so nice. So yeah, I've done a lot of the Nomad videos on TikTok, so check that out if you want to but yeah just to enjoy this a little youtube video because i do really love doing youtube videos but tiktoks is just sometimes easier even though i have to film from there as well <laughs> but anyway, i'll get everywhere i want to but this is i mean look at this pinko i love the brightness but also the how do you call it neon -y colors it's just it's a really nice combo of everything you can blend everything with everything the only thing that is a little bit of shame to me is orchid brome Lyo, and passiflora are a little bit too close for my liking even though they're completely different shades if you look them in a pan but i think if you put them on the eyes not that of much difference but maybe i'm wrong oh let's see if I'm gonna swatch those three now while I'm doing this voiceover and you not seeing my eye. Oh, well done in the filming, Sylvia. So yeah, I think there is a difference. I mean, the orchid is more pink, but then the bromeland and Passiflora, and they are different tones. I just, I don't know. I don't think you could see it that well in real life, but yeah. But it's still pretty and really beautiful and bright. So yeah, it's not that, but... Um, you know, I have to be honest, but that's my only, only pet peeve about this palette. Everything else about this palette I love. And in the meantime, we were putting glass wings on with a Morphe uh, pencil brush. Again, nice. A green, a vine snake this is. And this is also a small, I think also a Pillowies brush, if I'm right. I had a pink hand. I'm not sure yet. Ah, uh, well. You've seen the text. The text is correct. So just believe the text, because for that I'm checking it. And the voiceover. Yes, like I said, it's been a long while since <laughs> you did this film. And I didn't film it that well. Sylvia, stay in, in the screen, please. You can still see it, I know, but yeah. I feel like I have to get into filming properly again and make sure I'm in focus and on the screen. Annoying myself with that. Oh, well life no no sometimes it happens it has a little bit of fallout but not much it's just a couple of splodges but it's it's really not that much you could have done this with uh, after your uh, base and then it would be fine just as much but you know just to be sure my base looks flawless so let's cut my crease with my fresh ink in a re white and of course my 7072 brush i've already put some on so i saw that on the brush so Probably to decide after. Oh shit, I have not put my things on the screen. <laughs> my things, yeah. What color I'm using. Let's cut this out. I am really. I do. To be honest, I think it's funny because I didn't like rewrite in the beginning, but now it's growing on me and I feel like now it's opened. It's drying a little bit better and not, it's not as oily and creamy before, but actually like a really good texture. So maybe they did that on purpose because the texture changes a little bit. And I feel like now I've used it more. It's not as um, liquidy anymore. So it's also more coverage because now it looks like white white and it didn't look like white white when I first used it. So. You do see a little bit of the blue in the beginning underneath, if you can see that correctly, but that's about it. So, actually, quite nice. So, it dried down really beautiful, which, yeah, is definitely a plus for me. Adding a little bit more. I think in the end, it would be better if I would have made that wing a little bit bigger, but you know, that's now thinking. That was not me, Sylvia, thinking back then. So, still pretty, even the end result, but. 
you know, different. Now I'm feeling it back. That's funny, actually, because it's a while back. You see it differently. I really loved it back then. And I still do, but yeah, I don't know. Maybe you get pet peeves in the end now. I don't know. I love it, though. It is a pretty palette. And now we're going to go with shimmers. And this is Wildlife Wonderland. And eh, this, this, this shimmers. And this palette anyway, I love it. But these shimmers, I mean... Just see it build and see how pretty it gets. This would have probably been even more amazing if I would have wet my brush or used my finger. I just always forget to wet my brush and I don't like using my finger. Because you can't be as precise. And I'm doing quite precise looks, I feel like. So, you know, there's that. But, I mean, it is pretty. Look at that. I like it. Putting in a little bit of a different shape than I normally do as well. Going a little bit up to the top. I like it, like it. Good thinking, Sylvia, of the past. I think I made this be a long while ago. In the middle of summer, I think. You know, the end of summer? Hmm. End of summer. No, end of summer. It wasn't that bad. I've got some videos that it's on. So beware, and I hope I'm getting into it by doing this in the night. Because it's now after 12 o'clock, so... This is the color Green Mountain. And you just wait for it. <coughs> I mean, look at this. It's just so nice. Hey, look at that. Keep building it and making it your own color, whichever you love and prefer, of course. But look at this. Look at how it moves when you move your eye. I really like this. It's so pretty. Love the shims shims. Love shimmers in general. So I do have I done a matte look? I think I've done a matte look once or twice on occasion, but that's it. Again, a little bit out of uh, the screen, sorry for that. It's also because I think I've got a new phone I got a new phone in May. <coughs> and I had to figure out a new setup for filming because of it. I felt like it was more different than I thought it would be. So that's funny, right? So yeah, it is, it's, 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 maybe that's because it annoyed me a little bit that I did not edit and film as much as well. Because that annoyed me and made more TikToks because it was easier on the camera as well. But yeah, I do really, really love making long videos on YouTube. I do like the TikToks, but I do prefer YouTube. So. I need to get back into everything and have fun with it and do it. And look, look at these shimmers. And by the way, I went back in with Wildlife Wonderland. I don't think I showed or told anyone this, but yeah. Going back in with the green, the glass wings with the same brush I used before for it. But there's still color on it. And look at that. Oh, look at that pretty. I love it. So this is almost about it. You cannot, you're not going to see my uh, lower lash line because I completely filmed that off camera. This beautiful browns. Because I did want to use that too, so I used as much as possible. <laughs> yeah, well, that's uh, a little different than I thought it would go. But wow, this palette is so nice. That blended really nicely. The teals, the pinky purples, the greens, the brown orange and yellow ah oh, this is so amazing top a little nomad glass on top of my lippy of course I had to put that in because you know i own it <laughs> oh, i don't really love this this came out so nice i really happy with it so let's go in with switches because you know it had to be done so we're gonna start with Hanging Bridges, Jaguar, Glass Wings, and a Violet Sabruing. Okay, so Hanging Bridges, Jaguar, Glass Wings, and Violet Sabruing. Yeah. When I start going on the house, it was way better than swatches. Never under, do the word, understand the fact why swatches look so different from the real thing. It really boggles my mind. Boggles my noggin, how you call it. 
but yeah then we're gonna go in with cloud canopy orchid Roland and power trail oh nice yeah so that was cloud candy canopy sorry orchid that's pretty that went so nice on the eyes Bromlet, I've not used that one yet. The River Trial. That's nice. That is nice. So I never understand why the swatches with your finger look so much different when they go on the eyes, because that purple went so nicely on it. But it looks so chalky here. Ooh. But those shimmers are very pretty. So we're going in with Tukan, Wildlife Wonderland, Resplendent Quartel, and Magical Mist. Oh yeah, oh Magical Mist is nice. Oh maybe add Magical Mist in the corner. Oh okay, maybe. Should I? Should I not? Then we've got green Spinny Lizard, Blue Morpho, Green Mountain, and a Passiflora. Um, yeah, let's put them here. Don't know why. Should have put them maybe a little bit closer. Oh, look at that one. Also got that one on the eye. Oh, looked so nice. Then we've got the last two, two toed sloth and a green fine sneak. So those are all the swatches. Oh, I really love this one. This is also the one that's outside of my eye and I've put this one of course there you've seen the video so but maybe you went on to the swatches in the end i don't know who knows oh, i'm gonna put i'm gonna put this one in a corner just a bit tad bit let's get a brush in oh, yeah yeah let's get a brush in that one magical mist oh yeah That is a nice inner corner. Oh yeah, I really enjoyed playing with this palette. Oh, I didn't tell anyone. I've also got the Tokyo palette from Nomad. She sent this to me. So amazing, incredible with my order. And this is what that looks like. And this is what that looks like. So definitely to play with that one. If I see this, this is matte. This is like a satin finish and these are the shimmers. It looks so nice. Look a little bit, but this is yeah, this is pinky and this is purpley. Oh, and you also feel dual chromey in the bottom as well, so that's real as well. So be ready for that one. But today it was all about this one, the newest palette. I mean, look at that, and look at how it came out. I really loved how it blended, how it looked different shape or oh, shape not because I do wake that looks after, but you know. With the colors and everything but i really enjoyed doing it like this you know sometimes you just have to sometimes you know you always have to let the palette play and come out and this is what i came out with i don't really love it ah uh, oh lipstick on my teeth oh well yeah a little bit so yeah i hope you enjoyed my little video and if you did then please subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell give me a comment give me a like it would be amazing mean the world to me and uh, yeah uh, i hope you had a blast um i love you all be yourself be happy and i'll see you on the next one bye